Everyone talks about building muscle, but almost nobody talks about tendons. Muscles move weight, but tendons transfer it. And if your grip ever gives out before your back during a dead hang or a pull, that's your tendons waving the white flag. They're underdeveloped, and that's the real reason your strength plateaus. Monkey grip dead hangs target that exact weak link. They don't just make your hands stronger. They forge the connective tissue that keeps you from breaking under stress. Section two, tendons are your body's cables. When trained correctly, they store and release force like coiled steel. When ignored, they limit everything, your strength, your endurance, and your recovery. Strong tendons mean better power transfer, faster lifts, and fewer injuries. That's why elite athletes like climbers, fighters, and soldiers train for tendon resilience first. Muscle is just the engine. Tendons are the transmission. Without them, you're not building for real world strength. Section three, dead hangs are already great for grip, but monkey grips transform them into a tendon building machine. On a bar, the force is straight and predictable. Your tendons adapt and then they stop growing. But when you add rope-based grips, everything changes. You're no longer just hanging. You're constantly fighting to create friction, balance rotation, and stay attached. Every micro adjustment forces new fibers to strengthen. The result, denser collagen, thicker tendons, and longer lasting grip power. Section four, thick grips like these here or fat grips build crush style mixed with pinch style strength, but they're still stable. They don't mimic how your grip works in real life. Rope grips like monkey grips do. They've removed stability and force you to create it. You're not holding, you're clinging. And that's where monkey grips shine. They attach with a cow hitch knot, locking securely in place so they can't slip, twist, or rotate. That means all your instability is in the grip, not the gear. Safe, portable, and brutally effective anywhere you are. Section five, every time you hang from monkey grips, you're not just building strength, you're rebuilding your structure. Controlled tension signals your tendons to lay down new collagen fibers. And over time, those fibers become denser and more cross-linked. That's how you develop the kind of grip endurance climbers and wrestlers rely on. Grip that doesn't just hold longer, but holds harder when fatigue sets in. It's science applied to survival. Section six, if you can't hold your full body weight yet, don't rush it. Tendons adapt slower than muscle. But the payoff is huge. Start with assisted hangs, using bands or one foot on a box. Then build up to 20, 30 second unassisted hangs. From there, try offset or single arm holds once your grip can maintain tension. Two or three ses sessions per week is all that you need to trigger growth without overtraining. Your tendons grow when they recover, not when you push past pain. Section seven, grip like an athlete, not a lifter. Lifters build muscle, athletes build structure. Monkey grip dead hangs rewire your upper body to stay connected under pressure. When your tendons catch up to your muscles, your performance explodes. Whether you're pulling, climbing, carrying, or competing, because when your grip becomes your strongest asset, everything else follows. Come join us live every morning at 11 a.m. and every evening at 7 p.m. on Whatnot. We give live giveaways and always do flash sales. And we're great for live Q&A commentary. Whatever you want, we can chop it up. I will see you there.